years on this planet, and they knew a lot more than us today. What did the ancient people know? What we don't know now. A lot. For example, let us play with some magnets. Here it is, our old-fashioned magnet, North Pole, South Pole. Let's bring in some long magnets too. Point the opposite poles. Contraction. Ah, mm, some force. Let's rotate the long magnet. Now let's see if we can shape the magnet a little bit different. Now bring back. Did you see that? Again. We can conclude that this produce force. Force means motion. Motion means rotation. The Mayan engine. Okay, let's 
let's wire it. Now, that won't work, of course. Luckily, there was this great scientist. He knew how to transport electricity without wires. 116 years ago, okay? He also discovered a way to provide everybody on this planet of free power without harming the environment at all. Hmm, that's strange. It's not fair to place good love on great scientists in such a dark light. So, we have the power on place. But it still won't work. We need a superfluid. A fluid with no resistance at all. If we can get our hands on such a fluid, we need a very good container to hold it. Because if there is a hole of just the size of one atom of the fluid, then the fluid runs through instantly. We are getting closer now. Fill it up now, but we forgot a very important thing. Yes, the ring. The ring is a fluid too. Ferrofluid. Who makes the ring due the magnetic force? The setup is complete and we can start the engine.